Hello everyone, I am Hal and welcome to How to Win in Honor of Kings. Today's item build is on the hero Su Ma Yi, an assassin mage that can be played both mid and jungle, but today's build is for his jungle. Since he is ranking in the top 3 junglers with a high 53% win rate, this is due to his ability to cut down enemies in an instant, leaving them with no idea what even happens. Also a big part on why he is getting a lot of success is his new epic skin. Let's have a look at his build and get a crit ready to show off to all the China girls. Now with Akana, we're starting with Avarice Blues, gives magical life steal. Next is Mind's Eye for the attack speed and spell penetration. Attack speed is also important on Sumayi because you're going to be in melee range a lot of the time. And your passive slash is the core of your damage, where you do need a lot of attack speed to get them through in a short amount of time. Oh, and excuse the icon, I put in the wrong one. Last Akana, Red Nightmare, magical attack and magical pierce just to improve your overall damage. So this set of Akana can bring Sima Yi a high amount of magic penetration, maximum amount of lifesteal and a certain amount of attack speed. The lifesteal and attack speed effects that these Akana give is just perfect for Sima Yi. And that brings us on to the item build. Jungle item you want on Sima Yi like with any AP jungler is Gorilla Scimitar. And the special effects of this jungle item is that it gives 6 points every time you kill jungle camps stacks up to 20 layers and also it's passive it leaves a continuous explosion on the ground for two seconds causing spell damage every time a skill hit now this is great on sumayi because you are melee and if an enemy attacks you back they're going to be standing in this continuous explosion okay boots any ap jungler is going to get secret boots most of the time passive you gain points of spell penetration first main damage item wrath of the law master passive increased spell attack by 35 percent now this is a massive boost to your damage so as soon as you get this you are ready to start taking down all the carries remember as a jungler your main aim is to burst down carries especially it's even easier to do after you get wrath of the law master next item witchcraft staff spell attack max life max mana movement speed and it's passive after using a skill the next normal attack within five seconds will add 30 percent physical attacks on spell damage on summa Yi, your main source of damage is your enhanced basic attacks after you you use a skill which is your slashes witchcraft staff will increase these perfect item for summer you second last item vein rod mainly wanting vein rod for the 45 percent spell penetration the last two items on main hero you're going to be wanting spell penetration because by late game everyone's built up their magic resist and last item sage's book now sage's book is great on summer you especially in the late game because you are actually quite fragile and with 1600 life you're going to be having a higher chance to survive if you're wondering why I didn't go Hunter Akana, which is the attack speed blues. If you do want to go 10 Hunter, then you want to build Book of the God Eater in your build. But I believe this build is a bit better because most of the time when you're when you're taking down the enemy carries, you only need a few hits. And if you maximize your damage, you only need about two, three hits to take them down. So Sumo Yi's overall gameplay is not too difficult as long as you can continue to target the enemy opponent's shooters and mid laners. Once you get the hang of his burst you'll actually have a lot of fun killing them off by yourself and you don't have to worry too much about your team he has a very high win rate so i encourage you to try him with this build and see how you go and that's it for today see you tomorrow for another item build video how to win signing off